Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to another episode of Weekly Dose. This week we don't have much news to get to, but before we do get into it, if you guys are new in here and you haven't already entered my Black Widow giveaway, make sure to do so. All you have to do to enter is like this video, comment on the video, and subscribe to the channel. But without wasting any more time, let's get into it. Starting off with the Marvel news, Kevin Feige teased that we're going to be getting more prequel films after Black Widow. Loki episode 3 had very mixed reactions, but we did get a Lady Loki poster for the show. Amelia Clark says she's down to spend a decade in the MCU. We also got a new Shang-Chi trailer on Thursday. It featured Abomination and Wong. If you guys want to see my reaction, make sure to check out one of the previous videos on the channel and finally we got to see a super cool photo from the behind the scenes of fantastic four rise of the silver surfer where we saw the actor of the silver surfer post a cool photo showing that only his character's eyes were cgi and his body was actually covered in a silver costume moving on to the dc news Robert Pattinson's batman was supposed to come out last thursday but covid hit so we had a lot of rearrangements Zack Snyder's justice league is finally getting a 4k blu-ray and dvd release we got the new and final suicide squad trailer and it got me even more hyped for the movie and James Gunn also said that Peacemaker will be a lot different from what he is in the Suicide Squad and finally in the DC news Shazam 2 has revealed all of the costumes for the family. Speaking of family let's get into the other news. Fast 9 was released in theaters this week. We got a Halloween Kills and Candyman trailer. My most anticipated movie of this year Dune was delayed 21 days from October 1st to the 22nd. Steven Spielberg signed a production deal with Netflix. Scarlett Johansson is reportedly producing and starring in Disney's Tower of Terror movie. Rachel Kegler was cast as Disney's live action Snow White. All five Twilight Saga films are coming to Netflix in July. And finally, a new Transformers reboot was announced being called Transformers Rise of the Beasts. Hey guys, that's it for this episode of Weekly Dose. If you guys like these episodes, make sure to subscribe to the channel and comment down below what your favorite part of the news was. Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you next time. Peace.